First of all, from uh, Mr. Nohara Satoshi, Director General from Commerce and Information Policy Bureau, METI, will give an opening remark. Nohara-san, please. Thank you. So I am Nohara, Director General, Commerce and Information Policy Bureau, Ministry of Economic, Trade and Industry. I would like to say a few words on behalf of the organizers. Organizers, semiconductors, which are used in all kinds of devices from computers to home appliances and automobiles are extremely important key components that support the economy and society. The current global shortage of semiconductors is having an impact on the world's manufacturing industry. For example, by leading to production cuts in car plants. This is a reminder of the importance of semiconductors as a, as a key component in the supply chain. In light of this situation, the METI convened a panel of experts in March this year to discuss new industrial policies for semiconductors and in June announce its semiconductor strategy. The strategy points out the importance of developing semiconductor technology and of maintaining and strengthening the competitiveness of equipment and materials technology. The new Advanced Semiconductor Manufacturing Technology Development Project will focus on the development of front-end front miniaturization process and back-end 3D packaging technologies. One of the core of the project is Tsukuba Site, which is driven by TIA and AISD. In the front-end project, AISD will play a central role in establishing a shared pilot line for the manufacture of advanced semiconductor. In order to facilitate the development and operation of the pilot line, the Consortium of Advanced Semiconductor Manufacturing Technology has been established with members from the Japanese manufacturing equipment and materials industries and overseas advanced foundries and will be made available to all interested parties. In the back end project, the TSMC Japan 3D IC R&D Center will work with Japanese equipment and material manufacturers at AIST. In order to implement these projects effectively, TIA will collaborate with research institutions, including those overseas, to promote open innovation. We hope that semiconductor manufacturers, equipment and material suppliers, universities and other players in the semiconductor supply chain, both in Japan and overseas, will take advantage of these initiatives. The government also hopes that these projects will help to revitalize the semiconductor industry, particularly at TIA and AISD.